Well, Zach really loves going to the playground and being on the swing. We've got a swing in our backyard that he loves, but he loves jumping. So we go to trampoline parks. Um, COVID and that kind of, Zach wouldn't wear a mask for sensory issues. So it was kind of hard to take him places. So we're finally adventuring out again, getting used to being in social situations. He loves water parks. Um, he loves being in water. He loves to jump and take walks. He rides his tricycle. So we do things like that. He goes to his brother's um, you know, baseball games or watches him play hockey. So um, we just take him along so he can get used to being around other people and um, socialize with other people and kids his age. Cause he doesn't, he's not really playing with other kids his age yet. Um, so we're working on the social skills with him too. He was born in, in June 2nd of 2017. And then um, around 15 months old, our pediatrician noticed that his head was getting very big. Um, his circumference was off the charts. So he suggested we get an MRI. We found out that he had rare arterial venous malformation in his brain called vein of Halen malformation. So we went through Comer Children's Hospital and he had an embolization which sealed off the malformation, which is great. So because of that, he had developmental delays, walking, talking, um, so we got uh, early intervention through the state. And then when he aged out at age three, we were sent to Easter Seals Fox Valley DuPage um, at the Villa Park location. And we had speech and OT services there. Um, he made a lot of progress with that, which is great. However, we were noticing that his language was decreasing. Um, right around three, three and a half, we were just noticing that there was something else going on. So Dr. Peter Smith, he uh, is the developmental pediatrician who works through commerce, but also goes to Easter Seals to do diagnoses and things like that. He diagnosed Zach with severe autism in July of 2021. So um, once we got that uh, di a diagnosis, we decided to switch from just speech to DIR speech, which is more child-based. It helps kids with autism. Um, and he was with, he is with Ms. Barr for that. Um, and we love Ms. Barr. And then he is with Ms. Lauren for OT, both at Easter Seals Fox Valley DuPage. Um, he is making great progress and we're gonna continue that. And then along with, he's at our early childhood center here in Lombard. And then he'll also go to kindergarten in the structured program next year. So we've got everything, all the supports that he needs and we are grateful to have Easter Seals, Fox Valley View Page so close to us. We're about five minutes away and the staff there are wonderful and they've helped us a lot. He's just a really neat kid. We're really lucky he completes our family and we're lucky to have him.